Hey guys, uh, this is Bridges back with my another video and I hope you all are doing well wherever you are. So in today's video, I will be talking about coronavirus. I think it is one of the serious things to discuss right now. Because at this stage, the entire world is finding a solution to fight against this virus. But don't worry, I have got so much of information in this video that will help you to understand what is this coronavirus. How does it pass it on from one person to another person and what are the precautions that we need to take it in order to prevent ourselves from it. So just to grab all of this information, I think we need to go back to the history. See uh, guys, there are lots of rumors about coronavirus and it's not the first time there is an outbreak of a virus. If you could remember in 2014 we had MARS, Middle East Respiratory Syndrome Virus that had a mortality rate of 37% but this coronavirus has got mortality rate of only 4% which is quite less than what we had in the past so that's why we shouldn't get panic at this moment so now we need to understand what is this coronavirus this coronavirus is basically a large group of viruses that affects the respiratory system of human being and causes range of illness like common cold flu, breathing difficulties, fever, coughing and sneezing and in rare cases it also causes pneumonia and kidney failure. So these are the symptoms of coronavirus and now this coronavirus is also known as novel coronavirus which was initially started in Yuhan city of China. So, now how does it pass it on from one person to another person? See guys, uh, this coronavirus is passes through the cough droplets. When an infected person, he coughs or sneezes. So anyone who comes in contact with the person, he gets affected. So now we need to understand that how can we protect ourselves from this virus? See guys, I will give you number of things that we need to follow until this coronavirus is not going from our life. And trust me, if you follow all of these points, this coronavirus, it will never come to our life. Okay. So the tip number one is hand hygiene. That means, please wash your hand thoroughly throughout the day for 20 seconds with the water and soap. I know it is not possible. Most of you are thinking that, yeah, we are so much busy in our life. But don't worry. If it is most possible, then use a hand sanitizer to sanitize your hand frequently. Especially when you are touching a money or uh, touching a door handles or any of the trolley, the one which is there in a supermarket or any of the malls because that has got a maximum chances to get coronavirus because that trolley and door handles has been used by so many people throughout the day. Okay. Now the tip number two, always wear a face mask whenever you are going in a public gathering or anywhere in the market, super malls and all. Okay. So tip number three, like whenever you are eating an egg or any of the poultry item, make sure it is cooked well done. Now the tip number four, please avoid touching your face as much as you can because our hand carries lots of bacteria and trust me, this coronavirus, it only passes through our eyes, nose and mouth. Now the tip number five, which is Please try to eat vitamin C rich food, something like orange, guava, gooseberry, ginger or any green leafy vegetable because this will help you to boost your immune system. Now the tip number 6 which is whenever you are sneezing or coughing, make sure you close your face with a tissue paper okay? and discard that tissue paper after every single use. Now the tip number 7 which is please maintain 3 feet of ideal distance from a person who is suffering from cold, fever or any other disease. And uh, now it's last but not the least. Uh, there is one more doubt which I would like to clear it off. You know there are lots of people those who are thinking that if someone who is suffering from coronavirus they are going to die soon which is completely wrong. So guys please do not 
spread this wrong information to the people those who are not aware about this coronavirus okay and uh, once again thank you very much for watching this video till the end and if you have got any questions or any comments or any suggestions regarding this coronavirus please drop me in comment box till then goodbye